Um, the way that we prevent HIV infection is basically twofold. The first is a barrier method. So we're trying to stop bodily fluids of, um, that may contain HIV from getting in contact either with the bloodstream or the mucous membranes of a person who is not HIV infected. For This is the basis of safe sex, the use of condoms. So we're basically stopping, um, say, semen from being able to get in contact with the mucous membrane, say, inside the anus. Um, if there's micro tears from anal sex inside the anus, the condom um, is preventing the, um, the transmission of uh, HIV in the semen across into the bloodstream. For uncut guys, also be aware that the lining of the foreskin, the inside of the foreskin, is also a mucous membrane. So um, it is possible, and it does happen, that HIV can be transmitted from bottom to top, not just top to bottom. Um, there are new technologies called PrEP or pre-exposure prophylaxis, which can greatly reduce, reduce the risk of HIV transmission. We also know that people who are HIV positive, who are also on successful treatment with a non-detectable viral load, the data is very strong and it basically says that HIV is not able to be transmitted when a person is successfully treated for HIV infection. Um, this is a complex area though, so if you have questions, please talk with your doctor, your local sexual health service. If you'd like to have a chat with me, there's a contact button up there. More than happy to have a chat with you. Um, I hope you find this helpful. If you have any questions, let me know.